ever pondered about the diverse tribes that pepper the vast lands of South America, their unique customs, and their rich histories? Today, we'll journey through time and space to explore the top 10 tribes of South America. Beginning our countdown at number 10, we find ourselves with the Yanomami tribe. Nestled in the Amazon rainforest, the Yanomami tribe stands as one of the largest isolated tribes. They hunt and gather, living in communal houses known as Shabanos. The tribe believes in the interconnectivity of the physical and spiritual world, a belief that shapes their everyday life. Number nine brings us to the Guarani tribe. Known for their sweet tooth, the Guarani people were the first to discover the sweetness of the stevia plant. They believe in a mythical land without evil called Land Without Evil or Evimara I. Their journey to find this paradise has shaped much of their history. At number eight, we have the Shuar tribe, the headhunters of the Amazon. Fearless warriors, the Shuar are famous for their practice of shrinking human heads, a ritualistic process called Zansa. This tribe has a fascinating history of resistance against the Spanish conquest. Sailing to number seven, we encounter the Yagan tribe. They are known as the world's southernmost tribe, residing in the harsh climate of Tierra del Fuego. Despite the cold, they traditionally wore little to no clothing. Their language, also called Yagan, has one surviving fluent speaker today. At number six, we have the Embera tribe. The Embera people, residing in Panama and Colombia, are known for their intricate body paintings and beautiful woven baskets. They live in harmony with nature, a principle that guides their way of life. Halfway through our countdown, at number five, we find the Aymara tribe. The Aymara people, residing in the Andean highlands, have adapted to life at high altitudes. They have a unique spatial conception, where the past is in front and the future is behind. Number four brings us to the Mapuche tribe. The Mapuche people, located in Chile and Argentina, were known for their fierce resistance against the Spanish. They believe in a world full of spirits and have a strong tradition of oral history. At number three, we have the Ashaninka tribe. The Ashaninka, residing in the Peruvian rainforest, are known for their brightly colored tunics. They are deeply connected to the forest and its preservation, a commitment that reflects in their sustainable practices. The runner-up at number two is the Quechua tribe. The descendants of the Inca empire, the Quechua people have a rich history and culture. Their language Quechua was the administrative language of the Inca empire and is still spoken by some today. And finally, at number one, we have the mighty Tupi tribe. The Tupi people, once the dominant tribe in Brazil, have greatly influenced Brazilian culture. Their language, Tupi Guarani, was widely spoken until the 18th century, and their influence can still be seen in numerous place names. So there you have it, a journey through the diverse landscapes of South America, exploring its rich and varied tribal cultures. Each tribe with its unique customs, beliefs, and histories contributes to the rich tapestry of human civilization. Their stories remind us of the vast diversity of human experience and the many ways cultures adapt and thrive. As we move forward, let us not forget these keepers of ancient wisdom and their vital place in our shared heritage.